You killed Cuckoo. Hello everyone and welcome back to another part of the Sims 2 Bidly City Challenge, the Sims and Wins. Um, hit the subscribe button before we begin, you know you want to. So here we are with um, the Roselands. So this is Emily Richardson's household. The kids are at school. They're teenagers. They're not going to turn into adults yet. But um, they're on their way there. If you remember, he has nobody because he's not really too into anybody yet. And she... Excuse me. Wow, that was a yawn. Okay, sorry. She's with Elliot, um, and their relationship seems to be going pretty well. Unfortunately, most people are, like, off limits for them because they're family. Because the Richardsons are a very, very large family, if you remember, as you can see. Mm. And they're one of the first families with the car because they found a car in his inventory. He probably bought it from... Um, uh, John or something. Not John. What's his name? Christopher. So, uh, we're just going to use it. It's just going to be there. So, uh, the teenagers maybe can learn to drive or something. Um, actually, are they allowed to? I don't even think they can. Uh, wait. They can, right? I think they can, like, teach to drive. Uh, when the parents get home, I'll check that. But, uh, yeah. Let's see if she can... Let's, let's have her go. First of all, you need to fix your face. Uh, use some acne cream and uh, let's get her a more wintry outfit and then maybe we'll send her out with her boyfriend or her friends or something. Alright, so the family is here at their shop, the whole family, even the teenagers, so that they can learn the family trade. Um, just trying to get this up to level 10. It's currently rank 5, so we've got a way to go. We already got all the money because of her boutique from last time. This is in Emily's name, so that's why. Uh, we're working on these things, and we're going to pass them on to the children. So, you know, just the grind. So the team managed to get the business to rank 8 so far. So we've completed this, this, this. Um, this is also benefits from the last business that they had. So we finished this one, so I can't wait to start passing this along to the teenagers so they can have their own business. Um, I think I'm going to close up shop soon, though, because it's getting late, and their needs are all pretty low. But, yeah, we're almost to rank 10 it seems well not it seems we are almost to rank 10 uh, but it's not a very profitable shop so once we get there we're going to definitely sell it so i had danny ask calypso out on a date now why did i do that because they used to only have one lightning bolt but his his turn off oh, hold on his turn off was good at cleaning and like literally every sim in the game is good at cleaning so i changed it to stink and now he has two lightning bolts for Calypso. So let's see if we can, um, you know, have them, you know, have a nice relationship. Because I don't think Calypso's with anybody. I don't think so. Not that I, if I remember correctly. Um, so let's tickle Calypso. Uh, let's get some of these wants done. Uh, slow dance, no. Entertain, sure. So let's entertain. Try and be friends. The usual. All right, so they're officially crushes. Ooh, and they're you know getting all up on each other, and we've started rolling wants for the good stuff. So, um, hmm, should we go for it? Let's hug first. Let's do a little flirting first. Can you can you stop raining on my parade, Lucy Brown? Thanks. Um, so yeah, before we were interrupted by her attempt to interrupt them. Um, let's have a first kiss. Let's see if we can get a good screenshot here. They're at Gretchen's Bakery, by the way. Uh, which seems to be doing very well with business, I must say. Oh, okay, good. Good, good, good. Okay, um, Lucy, you're kind of in the way of my screenshot here, little miss. Lucy, are you serious? Are you serious, Lucy? Are you serious? How am I supposed to get a good screenshot? All right, I guess I guess that's gonna be it, guys. That's the screenshot. Oh well. All right, so they got the first kiss. Now let's get a makeout done, have a dream date, and then we'll let his sister go on a date too. Um, Iris, I mean, she'll go out with Elliot. All right, they are officially officially making out. Sorry, I was interrupted before my husband came home. Um, anyway, so they're making out. Let's see, they're almost at the dream date status. Mm-hmm. 
She wants a back rub. Let's let's give a back rub here. I would love a back rub too right now, but unfortunately, there's no one around now to give me a back rub because it's the morning after before my husband came home. Well, yesterday, last night, my husband came home, and then I stopped playing, and now it's the morning. My child is sleeping, and I am by myself again. I have dinner. Uh, well, not dinner. It's more like afternoon meal here in Greece. I don't know if you guys know, but like actually in Spain and a lot of countries in Europe too, I think we have something called like the siesta in the afternoon. Well, it's not called the siesta in Greek, but I think that's what they call it in English where like we eat our biggest meal at around two o'clock and then basically like maybe fruit at night. So like I have like our so-called dinner ready right now and it's like 1.30. Okay, date's over. Dream date. Very good. Oh, and he's getting famous. Okay. Great. So, uh, we might as well, while we're here, maybe buy something. Maybe, maybe get some nice things from this nice bakery. In this place, I swear to God, there's never anyone, anyone to come bring up the customers. Mark, you're not doing the greatest job here. Mark, forget the customers. Go ring them up. People, he's going to throw it on the floor. Um, Carol, you don't need to restock. What we need is somebody to bring us up. Look, Danny's having a heart attack. Thank you. Jesus, that took forever. Literally forever. My god, this place sucks. Alright, so now it's Iris's turn to go out. So she's gonna ask her boyfriend out on a date, Elliot. And maybe we'll go into this new community lot I placed. I'll explain when I'm done with this in a week. The two community lots I placed, um, their costs and how I deducted it from the town funds and why I placed them. Um, I'll explain in this when we're done but let's go check it out no one else is going where did i put it again it's in the commercial center cliff bar it's actually uh custom content i think they make they're making like some kind of joke about cliff bars and they made a bar called cliff bar makes sense does that make sense or, or am i the only one who gets it so here we are at cliff bar but it seems that the bars are non-functional hmm, i should have checked that the bars are not functional you can't actually drink here Oh, they just kissed each other. Okay. Okay. Oh, and they're officially in love, people. All right, let's talk. Let's talk to each other. Or maybe we'll go inside first. Well, let's just do this interaction first, and then we'll go inside. Um, Go inside. Doesn't it kind of look like they're dancing in this, like, screenshot that I'm about to take? It does, right? Mm -hmm. It looks like she's, like, doing some kind of crazy move here, and he's, like, mm, into it. Mm-hmm. Even though she's just telling a joke. But anyway. Up. Oh. Alright, she totally just twerked. Twerking? Actually, that, that actually wasn't technically a twerk. Excuse me. How is everybody? Is everybody okay? I've been like... Ugh. I've been playing Sims Mobile and Sims Freeplay so much. And like wasting time. And like not being productive. I have like a whole pile of clothes that I need to iron. That I'm not ironing because... Like, every split second, I'm doing something on Sims Free Play and Sims Mobile. I stopped playing Sims Free Play for a while, and recently I got back into it, and I have also played Sims Mobile, and I just, now I just can't stop. I just can't stop, people. Okay, where is there even any music playing? No. Is there a stereo somewhere? No. So, um... What kind of a bar is this? Sorry, Mr. Custom Content Creator, whoever created this. You know, your, your bar here is a little, you know, it's missing some stuff, just so you know. Okay, the classic dancing in the middle of the bar. Alright, that's enough. That's enough. You're making an embarrassment of yourself. Let's just make out and call it a day. All these people look so bored. It's like an empty bar. Where is everybody, actually? Did they go upstairs? Nope, it's just empty. And they're just making out, having fun. Might, might as well. They're children. They might as well have fun. That's what your young years are for, I think. You know, it's 11 o'clock. You have a curfew, miss. You do have a curfew, okay? You can't stay out all night. Okay? You're not one of those girls. You're going to be a good girl. You're going to go home to your parents, okay? Because that's what good kids do. And that's what I hope my daughter does one day. She will not be staying out till all hours of the night, okay? Making out with random boys. Well, not that it's random, it's her boyfriend, but anyway. Okay, time to end the day. Go home. Enough. You had enough fun for the night. Go home. Here comes Calypso, leaving a bouquet of flowers. 
So I had Iris just throw a party because she wanted to, it was in her wants, and there's like nothing for them to do today. She's passing along um, business benefits, so we just invited all the teenagers, and um, he's also making flowers upstairs. But, you know, let her, oh wait, she's in her pajamas, okay, you need to go upstairs and change, okay, and then entertain your guests. Okay, can everybody come inside? You're making out with your boyfriend, your mom's making grilled cheese sandwiches, sounds like a really good party, if I do say so myself. Just making friends with everybody. What's her thing here? 20 simultaneous best friends. So we can totally do that. Because we already have a bunch of best friends. And then we can work on her in relationship with Calypso, which is her brother's girlfriend. Right? You always want, you know, to have good relations with your sister-in-law and your brother-in-law and all that nonsense. Um, how does, what is his relationship like with her boyfriend? He doesn't even know him. Time to get to know your sister's boyfriend. And the party is a roof raver, razor. Wow. Can't even speak English. The party is a roof razor. I am amazing at throwing parties, if I do say so myself, even though basically nobody really did anything interesting, but besides the point. Alright, so it's Monday in the morning with his family. Um, basically, they threw a bunch of parties. He is going out with, what's her face, Calypso. She's going out with Elliot. Um, they're both going out with Fairchild. Um, except, well, not a fair child. He's a cook. She's a fair child, but um, they're related anyway. So, uh, their her business, the flower shop business, is going okay, but we're not at level ten yet. They have twenty thousand. When they sell it, then I'll do a reduction, a reduction of their funds, and um, add it to the to the college fund. So I'll show you in the neighborhood screen what I've done different. So one of the community lots I added is this blue water baths and salon. Um, community lot it's just like a salon with like a spa and massage and stuff and um that one cost about forty four thousand and twenty million so i reduced that from the family funds and then i'll show you the other one and then i'll explain why wait whoops and the other community lot is this bar that we went to earlier um so that what that means is that we have two creative sims that we can put in so i put in the ramaswamis here uh, they're here and uh, what that also means is that uh, we have another household and two more community lots this helps to increase the population we're trying to get it to around uh, 1,000 so that a lot of the careers open and people can make more money uh, we do still have enough money saved we still have 224,590 million so we're about a quarter of the way there to the university but people need to still um, make a lot of money. Uh, the reason why I really want to get to 1,000 population is because that is when we can elect a mayor and the mayor um, can collect taxes and like it, it's gonna be really fun I think when I when we get to that point so uh, we'll I'll explain more in that in that um, when we get to that point but my idea now is that because we have this money and it's just sitting let's pretend it's in a bank right and uh, we have all this money and I think it should collect interest every cycle. That's what, that's my idea. I think it should collect interest every cycle. So I think like most banks like, uh, let me look this up real quick. All right. So like most banks have like a really low uh, interest rate. So we're going to stick to 1%. Okay. 1% per cycle. So if we look this up, um, Let's, I mean, one person is even pretty high considering, but anyway. Uh, so we're gonna 224590 times 0 0.01. That's 2,000 uh, simoleons at, wow, that's actually really low. Mm, hold on. That's not really worth doing then. Now we're gonna make this 4%, okay? It's fine. We're gonna make this 4% times 0 0.04. And that makes 8,983 simoleons. Okay, that seems like a good amount to get every cycle for um, interest. So let me write this down. Uh, so we have, well, let me find my pen. All right. 224,590 simoleons plus 8,983 simoleons makes 2,033, 233,000. Wow, 233,573 simoleons. Very good. So, uh, yeah. So, every cycle, that's what we're going to do. So, we already did it for the cycle, and then the next cycle, we'll do it again. Uh, and that'll just help us get to our goal a little bit. Um, yeah. And at, when we have the mayor, the mayor can uh, sort of lend people money at an interest rate, and then they'll have to pay it back. Like, it'll get really interesting. So that's why I really want to get to population 1,000. 
Uh, so yeah, that's why we put in the community lots and we have another household to play this cycle, okay? All right, so here we are with the Simmons family. Uh, we have Calypso Fairchild and Luke Simmons. Now, if you remember, it's happened a while ago, but if you remember, he kicked out his wife. Well, he, she wasn't actually his wife. It was more like his mistress or his girlfriend. They were living together anyway. He kicked her out after finding out that the, her third child is not his. And at the same time, he also realized that the child that he was raising was also not his. So she, remember, has one child with... Um, Julian, one child with Luke, and another child with John Oakstead. So, um, yeah, things are a little complicated up in here. So he kicked her out, so now he kept his only daughter, which is his actual daughter, Calypso. And Calypso is with Danny Roseland. Um, I'm checking her. She wasn't too into Nathaniel anyway. She was into Elliot, but Elliot is with... Um, what's her face this other chick in the neighborhood anyway so oh she's going to school um so he is about to turn into an elder he's at the top of his career um we should probably throw him a birthday party or something um yeah we'll have him fix the house a little bit too somebody needs to do some gardening we still need to work on his aspiration uh and that's that so while i fix that let me update you guys i don't know if you can hear the washing machine in the background um I have to be honest, I haven't really been feeling that great lately. Um, like I haven't been playing a recording. I've just, I've just been so down. I don't know, I don't know what's the matter with me. Like, uh, I don't know. I think I just need some help. I think I'm a little overwhelmed. Uh, I think I've been, I've been fighting with my husband a lot lately too. Um, I just don't think anybody really understands me. Like... Okay, so we've thrown a birthday party for Luke. I just bought the uh, thing here, the birthday cake, because going to uh, the bakery always ends up with, like, we always spend hours there because nobody ends up bringing us up, so I just bought the birthday cake. It's fine. And uh, he's going to blow out the candles now. Oh, he wants to get a car. Well, you can't afford a car right now, buddy. So uh, what are you doing? Are you going to talk to your sister? Talk to your sister for a little bit. Oh, Reagan Sanderson, the mean witch, is here. And so is the good witch. Well, she's actually a neutral witch. Uh, maybe they can be friends. Are you guys going to interact? It would be great if you interacted. Anyway, so he needs to blow the candles. So let's get his phone up, finish this interaction, blow out the candles. Go blow, blow, blow. Okay, stop talking to the bird. Everybody watch. Everybody watch. He's blowing out the candles. He's about to turn into an elder. He's about to turn into an elder. Wow, everybody, everybody in this neighborhood is getting so old. It's ridiculous. It is ridiculous. Ooh, wee. He's old now, and he's pretty ugly. Um, anyway, so he's an elder. Everybody get a slice of cake. I sent Luke over to the Electro Center to buy his daughter a computer, and maybe we'll buy a TV too, since we don't have a TV. Uh, it would be good. You know, want to spoil your daughter a little bit. I understand. You only have one daughter. So let's go pay for items. Okay, you need to get out of the way though, LaShawn Cameron. Well, I just realized he should have gotten a lighter TV. So I'm just going to sell it and then just get another one and just pretend that's the one we got. Whoops. And it's too expensive. So we're going to do... Wait. Is this match? Does this match? Not really. We're just gonna get this one and call it a day. Mm -hmm. Um, the dogs are fighting. I have like no idea why they hate each other. Oh no! Oh no! Poor Scout. Jeez, Alabama. What the heck's your problem? You're supposedly like friends. You're a pack. What the heck's the matter with you people? This dog's lost his mind, I swear. Okay, scold, 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 scold. Scold these dogs, they're bad dogs. You guys are bad, bad dogs. Bad dog. So I'm just gonna have her go out with her boyfriend, uh, Danny Rosalind. Just, you know, like, not a date, just to have her go out, like, the actual option to go out. Alright, he's going to come pick her up probably, and then she'll go, and then they'll probably have fun. 
he is his, he wants to go on a far east vacation and i kind of want to that's why i locked it but they don't have money so maybe they'll go one day maybe they won't he's driving a car danny you don't really own a car i don't know where you got this this dump of a car but anyway speaking of dogs my daughter loves dogs like she's now she's like more aware and you know when she sees a dog like she looks at it like wide-eyed and if the dog like scratches its ear or something she starts laughing hysterically or if the dog barks she laughs hysterically she loves our rottweiler every time we pass by our rottweiler um he's outside she completely goes crazy and like love and like uh, she's just so happy when she sees animals it's it's hilarious hilarious i say um okay cuckoo is dead and i don't really know oh god that's so morbid look it's got like its feet up and everything and i don't know how he died like i was feeding him so i don't think he died of starvation i swear i was feeding cuckoo i think the dog did it where is that guilty dog it's this one this is the one that's always barking at it and being mean to everybody this is the dog this is the dog at fault here and he looks guilty too you killed cuckoo you killed cuckoo look at that face that's the face of guilt and he's just eating his food completely completely unremorseful of what he did cuckoo is dead ladies and gentlemen my god and he smells <laughs> so look look is bored so he's gonna invite over Sid Rosalind because Sid Rosalind is the father of his daughter's boyfriend and if they're gonna be you know co-father-in-laws uh, they might as well you know why don't you uh, bring out a gelatin for your guest uh, you don't need to take it one okay just bring out a gelatin for your guest maybe you guys can you know be elderly friends together mm-hmm uh, hello uh, father of the boyfriend of my daughter. I hope you taught your boy manners uh, Let's gossip about our children and share interests. Actually, wait, he wants to talk about hobby so we can do that Let's eat a gelatin together. Okay, let's be friends. Are they friends yet? No. Well, they're gonna be friends soon Oh, and and her daughter's home and she brought home a friend. Oh, Calypso, by the way, your your bird died But I'm sure you don't care so she rolled a wand to go out with Nathaniel, even though that's not her boyfriend. So uh, I decided to go, and he came in this car. Oh wow, he's honking. He's like, hurry up, girl. It's winter time. I wonder where they're going to go. I hope you don't do anything bad, because, you know, you have a boyfriend. I love how the car is, like, frosted. Mm. Wow, she wants to go with Elliot to cheese, girl. You've got a boyfriend, I hope you know. Wow. Some people, I swear. So, uh, there's so much snow that it's a snow day, but, uh, they ran out of groceries, so Luke is running some household chores. He's gonna come to the grocery shop, buy some groceries, even though he's, like, broke. But anyway, and then maybe he'll stop by Gretchen's Baked Goods and buy some baked goods for the house, because, you know, he likes to spoil his daughter. Uh, he only has one daughter now, right? Um, so let's go to Gretchen's Baked Goods and spoil our daughter with some dessert, because, you know, what are you wearing? You're wearing a short sleeve shirt in the middle of winter. So he's just gonna buy uh, one of these things and pay for item, take it home. I think that was like a pie or something. And, you know, might as well get her an another wand done. So she just asked her dad for permission to go out. Of course he said yes because he spoils her and now she's gonna go out with Elliot. Might as well. Might as well. I know you're a bad girl. It's okay. It's okay. She's so pretty. I love, I love her face. I love, like, the skin that she has. I, I totally I dig it. I know he's coming to get her soon. Great. Uh, why don't you uh, wash your hands or something? I don't know. Uh, and he's just going to be home alone again, doing nothing, because he's old and jobless. Well, retired, basically. And, uh, yeah. So she's made a group with her family, meaning her mom and her sister. Her half-sister, I mean. And uh, we'll meet at the spa for an outing since it's been a pretty boring sim week. Uh, so Sandy and Jane and Calypso will go to the new spa that I placed in the neighborhood so I can show it to you. 
Yeah, so here we are. I'm seeing I have some item issues. But anyway, um, so there's a stylist here. Um, I think there's things we can buy. Maybe. I don't know what, what I can buy. But uh, there's also masseuse. So uh, yeah, she's going to have a great time with her parents and her sister, it seems. Uh, you know, sister, I forgive you for not coming to my birthday party that time because you were mad that you had to leave. I'm sorry my dad kicked you out of the house. I love you anyway, okay? Hello, mother. I'm sorry that my dad kicked you out, but I'm sure you're fine. You did do him dirty, okay? Wow, it's winter time. She's getting in the hot tub. Okay, crazy. This should be interesting. Let's see what they're going to do to her. Uh oh, oh, I see. Oh, so I can just change it myself. Okay. Uh, what hair should I give her? I think somebody already has this hair in the neighborhood. This doesn't look good on her. Uh, honestly, I think this looks best on her, but we can try something else. Uh, this looks okay. God, I want to go to the spa, the spa so bad. There's a spa here, and I haven't been there since I was pregnant, because you're not really supposed to hang out in spas when you're pregnant. And, like, honestly, I really want to go, but there's no one to babysit, so no. No spa for me. So, it's Monday in the morning with this family. Uh, Calypso has been just going out with all the boys in the neighborhood. Um, but, of course, her boyfriend is still, what's his face, Danny Rosalind, although she's kind of into Elliot, who is the half-brother of her half-sister, interestingly enough. Um, and she also went out with her sister's boyfriend, Nathaniel. But uh, nothing really happened. They just went out. So anyway, uh, yeah, um, she's just been doing that. She got a makeover, had an outing with her sister and her mother. He has just been writing restaurant guides, uh, this option here, and trying to make some money. Uh, he's, oh, I need to feed the, kid, the pets. He's retired, so not a whole lot has been going on with him. Uh, he's just spoiling his daughter and buying her everything she wants. And uh, yeah, that's that. So let's go into the next family. Alright, so here we are with the Owens family. So if I remember correctly, this guy is a big star athlete. He's also kind of a... Let me not let me not say what do you think he is. But anyway, um, what do we do? Okay, listen, you're driving me crazy, kid. You're driving me crazy. Um, she's pregnant. She wants to have like six kids. I don't know how I feel about that because he seems to make some really ugly children. Like this kid. I don't know. I just don't know about six ugly children. But anyway, uh, yeah, he's like almost at the top of his career. He's not really there yet. We need to still work on some skills. So that's what we're going to do. Uh, he's stop playing, uh, study, some mechanical. And uh, she's pregnant again, obviously. Uh, dispose, are you feeding the baby? She's feeding the baby. Uh, yeah, just that. Uh, we'll see. Like, I think this kid's going to, no, she just turned into a toddler. So we have all her skills to do. And, uh, yeah, she's going to get pregnant again. They need a bigger house for sure, though. So I'm going to, like, consider, wow, well, excuse my voice. I'm going to consider moving them out and uh, maybe building them a new house, like, right now so that they have some room. Or maybe after their some week is over. Actually, maybe I'll do it now before Monday passes because it starts the Monday over. Um, okay, so this is the new house. I'm not really finished furnishing it. Um, they need to make a little bit more money. But uh, it's big enough, it's EA, it's nothing by me except the furnishing. And Kaylin is going into labor, it seems. So let's see what it's going to be. Maybe it'll be a boy, maybe it'll be a girl, maybe it'll be two babies, we'll see. Um, mm -hmm. Let's see. Let's go. Okay, it's one baby and it's going to be a boy. Okay, so it's a boy. Hmm, what are we going to name this kid? What are we going to name this kiddo? Hmm? You know what I don't have yet? I don't think I have a Michael. Do I have a Michael? I don't think I have a Michael yet in this game. So let's name him Michael. Michael. Oh, by the way, Rocker Boy 342. Uh, this rug is by... Dun, 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 dun. Where is it? It's called the BB Sage Rug by Buggy Boos. Okay, and it's like the most, guys, it's my favorite rug ever. It's got a million and five designs, and it never ends. You can just pick whatever you want. It's awesome. Awesome. Awesome rug. I highly recommend. 
All right, so it's her kid's birthday, both of them. Um, Asher's going to turn into a toddler, and Michael is going to turn into a... Wait, what am I talking about? Asher's going to turn into a child, and Michael's going to turn into a toddler. So, wait, we're not inviting over his ex-love. Anyway, Anna Kramer, uh, I guess some neighborhood people, why not? They're not really good friends with anybody. We need to work on that. Wait, actually, she's not, so he needs to invite them, actually. The party is a snoozer thus far, but she took out a thing so okay we can't call people to that meal who is she not really friends with she can try and make friends with uh john oakstead why not all right let's have the baby uh blow out the candle this is why i've decided she's not going to have the five children that she wants she has the aspiration to have five children but i don't think this is a good idea i don't think bad genetics should get spread honestly <laughs> honestly i'm not a fan I'm not a fan of this this genetic makeup here, so let's see what she looks like as a child. Because if it's unfixable, she's not having any more kids. Because poor Michael's gonna be ugly too. The way, by the way, by the looks of it. Oh, why is this a disaster? Why did my party go from a good time to a disaster in a matter of seconds? What the heck happened that made it into a disaster? Does anybody want to know? Why did my party become a disaster? Is it because I called the kid ugly? Oh my god. She's hideous. That's why it's a disaster. Oh, she's hideous. Well, too bad. Let me see if, if this is fixable in the slightest. Hopefully it is, but I doubt it. Oh, uh, okay. I mean, it could be worse. Her nose is, like, really bad. Her lips are really bad. Like, just the whole, the whole thing is pretty bad maybe this thing can cover her face a little bit or maybe this hairstyle can cover her face a bit i think this one covers it a little more mm -hmm. yeah uh, maybe some makeup will help the kid look a little more normal okay we're bringing the baby to the cake let's see how ugly this kid is hopefully he looks at least a little more like kaylin because he doesn't look ugly right now but they never do until they become a toddler it's when they become a toddler that they start looking but ugly yeah but you see what i mean you see what, see what i mean See what I mean? Look at this one. Look at this one. Oh, God. You're not having five kids. Caitlin, this is your last baby. I hope you know. That was her last baby. No more babies for her. No more babies for her. She's got such a pretty face, but look at the face of her children. Look at that face. Since, um, what's his face here? Zachary got promoted. I did some more furnishing of the house. So upstairs didn't really change much. I just made this into a boy's nursery. Um, I did the girl's room. I fixed her bathroom a little bit. And then I really furnished downstairs. So when he gets promoted again, I think he's got one more to go. Um, I think we'll really finish the house. She's doing really well in school. She had brought home Noah Kramer before the other ugly kid. And they'll be a great match one day since they're both ugly. Michael's miserable and sleeping. And, uh... He's working on the last couple of skills, and she's also miserable in general because she's raising two children. <laughs> so, um, since uh, we unlocked 500 population, which means we unlocked services, I thought it would be appropriate to order our first... Wait a minute. Oh, wait, wrong button. To order delivery. So let's 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 call for delivery. Maybe pizza or Chinese food. Let's see. What are we gonna order? Mm. Well, let's order Chinese food. Mm -mm -mm. I miss Chinese food. There's like no good Chinese food in Greece, by the way. Like none, whatsoever. So yeah. Okay, he's working with skills. This kid's trying to sleep. Take a nap until Chinese food Chinese food comes. Thanks. Here it is. Oh, I love waiting for my food. Come, 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 give me my food, ma'am. Sir, Joel Livingston, whatever. Accept delivery. Ashford's starving. Hello. Hello, my daughter's starving. Bring in the food. Thank you. Delicious Chinese food. Come grab it up. Grab up the food, people. Alright, so it's officially Monday in the morning with his family. It was kind of a difficult playthrough. I'm not really sure why. I just, like, find, like, I wasn't really good with time management this week. This kid's already crying. It's, like, 8 o'clock in the morning. Why are you crying? Why are you being like my daughter? Like, my daughter will wake up. 
usually she wakes up happy. Like she wakes up smiling. It's like today, like it was like 7.30 and she just woke up and as soon as she saw me, she just started crying. I'm like, really? This is how you want to start the morning? God, we had such a bad day today. Anyway, so yeah, uh, that's the end of this sim week. I'm going to probably end this part here. Yeah, that sounds about right. Uh, have a great day or night or whatever it is in your part of the world. Subscribe if you like my channel. Take care and bye-bye.